Yes, check it. What's up? It's the messenger, the apex predator. 125, stand up. Yo, check it. Opa lidae kunitoka, bila yu itoka, so kiusikizi li reach Ka uje jua ni makosa, kujaribu kuzoza, harifa na dae kukudik Tukibonga na ngalia mbota, sina ato time ya kukuwa assist Walikamo kasumbua kiasi, sukizu wako wapi, ya tu wako zabe, zabe Bagu nito watu kejani, kani kunjeni, grind na kumalis Chom ni pati ni kiriraksi, kari forward ka uda yutu banji Last year ni liacha mjibambe, 2024 wabani wachache Wezi ni pata na umati, shuffling, shuffling, fukuzo ngati Wanadhani ni kuma ganji, saagodi ya mesiki ya yuwa bari Lilinde kutoka mafala wotha ni life ni raisi my guy Wanadai kuni diss wala guy wanadai hawa dream ni king 1 to 5 Toka raonga di east wanagwaya usharo ushaga bista uski Yo mama pereka IG wezi karibishu wa in pandehi Chuo tulisha somaga saijoni na degree ya streets And I just turn 29 my boy that means I'm just getting lit Swear to god I'm just getting lit yeah 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 it is what it is Kano dae rusha mikono woski it is what it is Alijamjo atiana day pro bono wongo it is what it is Kasi ganja tu banji kapish It is what it is It is what it is my boy my boy my boy I raise what it is Kano dae rusha mikono woski it is what it is Alijamjo atiana day pro bono wongo it is what it is Kasi ganja tu bongi kapish It is what it is It is what it is my boy my boy my boy What's that? So it is what it is. Is um, nilikuwa na celebrate the nonchalance of rap. Where to not do as much as, for example, like I like to create, like my latest song, Thankful. I like creating, you know, introspective pieces, but also, kuna timingi ni nafaga tu na flex. You feel me? So it is what it is was one of those where I was like, hey, a genuine deck you too. You know, like in Kana ingia gym kidogo. Ama this is where if you've been in a gym for six weeks, una post yourself you ki. You know, so it is what it is. It's kind of that just flexing. You know, so um, kuna stories up on the street. Kuna stories zime happen. Kuna stories na address vitu na una around me. Cause kuna una na like where um wana dani ni koma ganji sa godi mski yu abari. Cause ni ile ushe umba mtu doa kwa like, wewe. Na venye wewe una, I'm like, bro. Ata nkisho, kuna time zone imele tuona senke. Nika drop you up area. Alafu, nata kumlipa. I'm sure, eh mazi. Uliza limiti yangu ime. Hai, unako gana fuliza msani. You know. You know, so I'm like, as much as muna dhani niko maganji. From your mouth straight to saja. Hey, you feel me? So it's it's those satirical lines like that where it's like um, real life situations mixed with some sat- satirical lines, you know. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so that that's what I would say. It is what it is was about. Yeah. So in answer, openly they couldn't talk. I believe you talk. So keep skizzily rich. Um, this is where when I face opposition, I'm say. And Anna and Dana, you see, a gun gives you power over life and death. But if a man doesn't have a weapon. Then I see to to Russian enemy corner, but you know, and it's it it's, it was reminiscent of to go to a, come go to look at fast body, second body, una funga shule na mse, you know, and I miss that about like conflict, cause men nowadays are so soft, and by soft, this is what I mean. Me and you are gonna get into it, and you you scuffle me. Tene ineshi apo like asa atatuna. Zai, oh, mini shiny, I'm hot, yeah. Then I round up the homies, na machupa na nini, we can't mess you up, you know. So it was like, nah, mikono zirushu, you know. Yeah, it's all about respect. If you if you mess me up, I'm like, ah, it's in a tea. If I do, ah, it's in a tea. You know, so that's my soak is the rich. Kaujeju wa ni makosa kujaribu kuzoza, harifa na daiku kudig. That's about the jealousy that comes with friends. When they see you, and I've personally experienced it so many times, when you try to break through into a different threshold, people wo- people mess with you because you are here, and they're comfortable with you being here. The moment you change Kidogo, it makes them uncomfortable. 
Yeah, I love who like my day ones, my bro. The same niggas are gonna be your end, Majua. Yeah, so Arif, Arif, what I could dig, you know, and I've actually seen that happen with me and with the homies around me. Kibonga na ngali ambota sinata time ya kuku assist. Cause now when you come to me with that fake shit, I'm like, yo, yo sinata time ya kuku. Yeah, I'm on some other things, you know. Sinata time. Daddy apa na sema. Wako zabe zabe. Ni mtu ana make some moves. You may chill area mki. Yeah. Hey, what do I like what are we doing? What do I let's make some moves like. So I think that was a wako zabe zabe because what are we doing? Tunaza chill hapa if you all are smoking, smoke if tunashika tea, tushike tea. Yeah, show me in in 2 weeks, 2 months, 6 months. December may Isha January na make new year's resolution then and then I'm back to the same cycle you know um yeah and tuko kumbuka is ningo matenema bagu ni toa tukejani kani kunjei ni grind na kumalis back to what i was saying bagu ndo na nitoa nje na afu kani ko nje ni grind hakuna hapa ati feelings ati oh street so so nah bro is business first even if i don't like you as a as a human being is business first unajua and that's also tied to the music because to me attach so many feelings especially nowadays to to the art where it's like if you if i feel like you for example um i've been around artists who now when i look back in hindsight <coughs> they <coughs> i felt like they were better than me But then how I responded was Unadua. But at the time nowadays Nico like what, what is it about this person that is acting me so much? What is it? What is it triggering? Oh my insecurity. I feel maybe and I switch better than Now instead of me looking at him like hey bro your flowers the the normal reaction is you know so yeah I, he, the song was about that just lyrical flex of like real life situations that we face yeah 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 it is what it is uh c'est la vie such is life it is what it is and that's that was my mantra when i made that song things weren't going my way hey, bra it is what it is to look at it is what it is you know and then um It is what it is. Kona day, uh and I day to work pro bono, wongo. You know, cuz for years as well, I would allow that to happen. <clears throat> cuz I mean really struggle sana ku kupata studio time na nini. So anytime a guy would come, hey, mazi chare chare and be like, man, hata mimi mazi ni kiwewe mazi. Welcome to tokens in Asia. Welcome to like ni to wait to jua. But nah bro this is my bread and butter you know so you know pro bono work over here and it was also to discourage um at the time I felt like I was getting too many DMs from upcoming artists wanting a handout you know na hizo handouts bro keep your hand out handouts out of value hiyo kitu if I give you 30 bands right now utaikunywa by jioni cuz you didn't work for it unajua so it was just to address that where it's like I get so many DMs of guys who do recording deals, do you? Like nah, bro, put in the work. You know, like to put an embele. I love we shim the art in, enough to invest in it. Miss kwambi when they will pay you 70k kufanya video. Nah, but you know, do something that will get you from here to here. And that that was my process. Like nilika even iko like and that's why my whole thing is so DIY because unaweza ka hapa na tutet ah mas in the game the game ah mas in my promote now nah, what can we do like so be solution oriented atuna producer umsiala ku produce atuna videograph we learn ku alafu ule mse si ule msali bai wa menje na madake toko na mpe punch you know eh, ah atu atu pe we learn we mas we learn ku si youtube Eh hey, atuna atuna team and wewe si unakoga na masuti zile za atacho yes. na unajua kuonge enda huko roro you know so that that whole it is what it is was like just be solution oriented that's a kukapo kiwalo in oh my god 
Yeah, man. So that was it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Yeah, I think we are allergic to our own. Mm. That's the best way I can put it. Okay. We are allergic to our own because we always, every time there's something trash happening, is when we promote it, but we don't promote it to sell it. We promote in terms of, you know, Kenyan music, you know, yeah. every single time. Yeah, but then when there's something dope, yeah. kill him, yeah. Yeah. Uh, you know, so. <laughs> Yeah, man, but what I do like that's happening nowadays is the alternative scene is popping. Mm. So, kuna communities in a come up. Every weekend, kuna gigs, nine gigs in attend on 10 to 50 people. And that's what we need. Yeah. Yeah, we need that kahola silent uprising until it of Kamahali. Uko like, akuna Kenyan music mzuri kila msako le. Okay. 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 Yeah. 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 Um, I like the space we're at right now. Um, even with the Abenton kids. Because me, club. Your body, they man. Come on, man. But say, you I'm catching a wine, Nikiskiza Sheng, Unajua. That's different. You feel me? But as much as the Kenyan rap scene is, because Abenton is also rap. Yeah. But that's a conversation most people are not ready for. Really you know? Like. But I love what the Kenyan rap scene is. My only problem with hip hop. Mm-hmm apart from rap is to make it to adapt so most people are still stuck in uko flani you know the kinshakas the, when there's so many new dope cats you know and then you know, when you when you're rapping in english when you could have both. so you those two small small to mambo jumbo siasas besides that i love where we're at right now i love the freedom of creativity that Ska can drop a dope ass rap song. Nabado and they are to a super poison. Nabado up a BN verse. You know, I love it. Yeah, man. So Mali Tuko, I love it. I can't complain. Yeah, the Ke- Kenya has something to say. It's tricky because Nilianza Kucheza, the keys in church. And my first ever interaction with keys, I was 10 years old. Mm-hmm. Like you know, a church ni kwata na reach ju don't if you care. Um, but then my first verse I wrote when I was 11 years old because I remember my mom is a lecturer so mtoto amolimu na masomo you know nimetoka shule na ambi wakuna kucheza endo usome so nilikuwa naangalia to ceiling I even remember the verse isn't it masai enda choma but yeah so I think <laughs> yeah 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 <laughs> exactly um. <laughs> But I guess they all sort of formed around the same time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. So I guess now, one year apart. Because mm. kids, I was 10 years old, Nikki Tri Kwani Shwat Dore me. And when I was 11 years old is when I wrote my first bus. I can comfortably say right now, or like the past one, two years is when I, I've finally caught up to the balance. Because oh, seemingly one was always coming before the other. Because I started out uh, making beats in high school. Mm. And then rapping, you can rap mango maza to ingine. That's what I'm okay. But beats, now on the kinanda, iso keyboards, iso the casio ones, you can make a loop, put a drum, like, you know. Mm. I wasn't doing anything serious. But then after high school, when I first got into the studio and actually rapping, and then I joined this rap crew in Rongara. And I was rapping, but I would tell them, oh, a mini producer. But no one ever had my beats. I had a squad in Shea and Bakwa software. I got a keyboard, you know. Mm. So I was a rapper for so long. And then I decided to now try the seriously into beat making. Mm. And I remember the first beat I fully made it to the whole night. So I was a youngin, I was sharing my my room with my bro shout out to king mike ali doze and it's a collab to panam kasubui and uko hapo bado and don't go memorize the eight bar loop you know yeah. but um it was always like that one was always coming taking priority over the other but then recently i think with maturity and age don't even kamali i can comfortably you know bob and weave between either 
Yeah. It depends on what you need to do. You know, I, I've learned to, you know, kumachisha, kum, kum you know. Mm. So if I'm in a room where I'm required as a producer, a chara na chiza chini. But if in Komali, hey, 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 a chara na roro, you know. <laughs> so, yeah. Again, when I say now I need strike a balance, is when, because off camera, you know, Liza, say where you are right now. Are you rapping more? Are you producing more? I started out producing for myself because nilikuwa naenda back in the day studio zikuwa mingi nilikuwa naingia studio na ambia producer check in ada hivi amezoea kuunda mabongo na ma, you know so ana niunda tu was like sinaweza nilikuwa naunda hizi vitu seko you know so I started out for me and then 2019 I dropped my debut project Rain the LP which was fully self produced Now when the hip hop scene got into it I call like ebu do ndo ulu ndile ngoma si hata mimi so I'm like wait oh oh umane za make chums na iphone you know yeah so that's when I started but then I realized I'm not like a producer producer where you like not a beat guy mm. for me I'm more of a collaborator yeah so I only work with people who gravitate towards my sound mm, you vibe together cuz I find myself very uncomfortable when i'm required to overdo something that you know like nimeunda drill ndio nimeunda reggae nimeunda but only when i want to mm. so i think that's the most important key if i gravitate towards you um for example to your side that the reason why we work so easily is i'll just do ni keys nini 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 ashaanza kuandika twende sana but the time we diverse I can record me pianisha and like you know um and same with a few other guys I've worked with where it's like I send you a curated folder cuz when I niki kai even niko like hmm so and so on I feel boom 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 and it came to me a true to the fact that of vibe now you know so I think I choose where when you tuna gravitate towards each other yeah it's less about oh unataka beat in a sound camp na nah, ah. it's This is what I have. Can you vibe with it? Yeah, yeah. It's all about the feeling, bro. Yeah. Very yeah. nice. Lots of records is um we stand for something. You know, we stand for something because it's so easy especially nowadays with the accessibility of equipment. Right now as long as uko na 9 to 5, uko save salo ya miezi mbili usha by studio kwa nyumba, you know. And then kuna AI ina ku mix and master here. Unaika YouTube, you know. So right now it's so easy to be an artist. But as we stand for that purity of respecting the art. And which is why I didn't end up my interview with Nicole like me ata si it shagi do a feature. You know because I I want to respect the art enough because be a miss daily pia. It's about the art. Mm. And so if I like a tune we can work on something whether you here or here or here. Understand. If you can't, I'm sorry, bro. The art should be respected. So I think that's what we stand for at Philosophy Records. Nice. Not, we stand for something. Any apples come to pata taka. <laughs> oh, I'm not hating on you. That's on you, bro. Like sawa, you ifanye huko. Hapa tunasema kitu, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's uh that was us, me, X-Ray and Marcus. Uh the two guys that are also on the track. Um tulikuwa make our two studio and then as rappers you know we are always making songs we were like it's funny to different we are so used to doing that let's do something different and then in the background i had uh, an r&b mix playing and then i kafka asha and mr pc again it r kelly yeah mr pc yeah r kelly and asha same girl leo ngoma yeah And then I was like yo ni kitu ka click like see we do like a Kenyan spin on this and then we customize it you know mm. because I'm a huge fan of storytelling and we were like situ showcase to and then we did what reading yeah nice. yeah nice. that's a friend of mine mm-hmm. a dope rapper um nilim fanya album during covid times So when he was album because he belongs in a duo on it was just jinga. So that's where I actually got my tag from because every song akianza alikuwa anaanza 
philosophy records manze cha pump your track bana yeah nikaichuna nikaichukua i'm like this is Ah no that's my that's my boy and to Blacky. Uh-huh. Shout out to Blacky. Yeah. Ni um he's he's a dope dope guy. Okay. Um grew up in Detroit. Mm-hmm. Alafu Detroit Michigan alafu Kakamoko. Mm-hmm. And then he's he's he raps. Okay. So yeah, uh, if you listen to most of my songs I like putting some sort of skit. Yes. Cuz you know I'm a huge film fanatic napenda ma movie napenda mm. ma series yeah. napenda visual storytelling cuz i also i'm also into videography as well nice so nilimwandikia pia script akai akai hack unajua but that was like a satirical <laughs> yeah, take yes yes it was a satirical yeah. take on my hip hop head unajua mm. what's the message yes, dare, dare, dare to be different dare to be different that's all i would say okay. yeah especially in a world of uniformity na pressure ya social media so go pia ku stand out whether that's by fashion whether that's by how you talk whether that's how you know there to be different yeah, yeah. wake up early to a cup of coffee in the morning shorty in the bed her whole body was anointed probably like cook a breakfast if I wanted then I meditate just to appreciate the moment I got options I can get it now if I wanted remember when I had a flat stomach Mama walking part time just to feed us lunch time and supper home with the chain on his back in the back of cocas he was selling kushwa limo clear in the coca i been seeing in years where he got up pick him up in a foreign and he talk up uh, that's why i'm grinding to a mocha and i've been turning down bad chicks it's a wonderful feeling you should try it to a promise for that shit for feeling i'm with queen in the back of the building really find me in the club but less the pain me got a whole team to feed man fuck your salary never share a vision with you niggas cuz you're too in sync with the system my body your gland out here doing back flips to dani mario kart and gifted ah uh, that's proposition of cackiness from a mathematician killing beast the only time i really get malicious other than that i'm as humble as a christian or a muslim or a buddhist or a pagan or an atheist up on sabbath skew a kwanza to the sabbath shit i ain't even six foot but the sex good shit scratching on my back in the restroom We ain't make it to the bed, we ain't make it to the couch, but I got a head back all the best dudes. She get me stop it up like a pro do. And I'm out here in the streets like a mogul. Big homie said you can't loaf around all day and still make bread. Uh, for your your fans too. No, he's...